Hello friends, welcome. In this video, I'm going to populate the tables and also create uh, relationship methods. So first, let's go in the VS Code and op open the database, migrations. And here I'm going to open the categories. And what we need for the category, we need the name. So, and we can add also the description, but I'm going to add only the name. So dollar sign table string and add the name also i'm going to add the slug so dollar sign table string for slug and now the slug is going to be unique okay save this and open the post now here we need to add the category id so let's add first the category ID. I'm going to say origin ID, category ID, add the constraint and on delete, I'm going to say cascade. Okay, after that, let's add the table string for the title. dollar sign table string for the slug and here also the slug is going to be unique what we need other we need the content so dollar sign table text for the content and i'm going to add also the boolean is published or not so let's say boolean is published and by default is going to be false so default false save this and open next table which is tags for tags we need also the same we had for the category so we need dollar sign table string name and let's copy this duplicate change the name to be a slug and also here the slug is going to be unique let's save this one close and let's open now the post tag pivot table and here i'm going to remove the table id and table timestamp i'm going to add only the origin id first for post id is going to be constraint and let's copy duplicate and change the post id to be a tag id okay save it close this one and let's open the terminal and run artisan migrate okay very good now let's open the controllers and make the relationship methods uh, sorry not controllers but models open first the category model and here i'm going to say first i'm going to create the protected dollar sign fillable and we need the name and slug for the category okay after let's create the public method for uh, posts now the category is going to have many posts and let's return dollar sign this has many post class okay save this one and open the post model also here let's first create the protected dollar sign fillable which is going to be the category id the title the slug 
what we need we have also the content and the is published or not okay now let's create the method for category is going to be singular and we are going to return dollar sign of this now this post is going to belong to the category so belong to category class okay also we need to create the relationship method for tags so let's say public function tags and here we need to return dollar sign this belongs to many belongs to many and at the tag class save this close and open now the tag model the same protected dollar sign fillable which is going to be an array with a name and flag Now let's say public function posts and here we are going to return dollar sign this now this tag belong to many posts. Okay. Now we have the relationship if we go in the browser let's open the filament php and go to documentation in the resources i'm going to create a resource for the uh, category post and tax so we need to run the php artisan make filament dash resource and give it the name so let's copy this go to the terminal and paste that in first let's create the category resource okay next let's create the post resource and also the tag resource okay now if i come here and refresh we can see we have categories posts and tags right now everything here we have no records records found because we don't have any tags but also we don't specify how what we can display here the same thing for posts and categories for that we are going to work in the next video so see you there